Morning. Good morning. Good morning. Did you manage to sleep well after what happened yesterday? Hasn't shown up yet. But she should be awake by now. How can you be sure? That girl is always on time. She has this routine for her skin. She's always up before breakfast. But it's already nine o'clock, so why haven't we seen her yet? Could something have happened to Beth? Stop your nonsense! <laughs> Let's go see if she's in her room. Weird. The window's wide open. Where has Beth gone to? Watch out! You're welcome. Watch where you're going! You almost gave me a heart attack. <laughs> That's Beth's lucky charm. It's a gift she got when she was still a trainee. It's been with her ever since. You guys... Don't 
Don't you think the bear is weirdly shaped? It's... it's different from the usual. Is... is there anything in it? Is... is there anything in it? Open it up now! Beth just needs some time to recollect herself. Let's go get her some food and a simple change of clothes. It's okay. 
You're safe now. Yeah. <laughs> I, I... I don't know. I can't remember. I think I heard someone enter my room this morning. When I opened my eyes, I saw... I saw a tall figure. I think it was a man. He hit me with something. And before I know it, I was already out cold. <laughs> I'm so scared. Is somebody trying to hurt me? Please don't. <laughs> Any luck, Gerald? No. I've already enabled the in-depth scanning and fingerprint recognition functions. Still, I couldn't find anything suspicious in the room. There weren't any strange fingerprints on the window either. I know this is the second floor, but the roof of the veranda is just outside. That means the culprit would have no problem escaping through the window. Could this culprit and the one who attacked you and Yulia be the same? Does that mean it could be the same person? Huh? Somebody texted me. This, this is exactly like what happened last night. No, I don't want to read the messages. Give me the phone. done? Then let's get back to the matter at hand. I'll let Gerald do the explaining. I just checked the messages. They're almost identical to those Yulia received. I'm tracking the sender's IP address and we'll get a location soon. <laughs> this has to be the work of some hater. It has to be. I agree. This is all your fault, Annie. This is all because of you. Your haters did this. They're trying to kill us. That's right. You remember what they did to you, right, Annie? 
The drink you got came from a fan. But it turned out that it was from your haters. They put glue in the drink. You even drank it! You... Shut up! Why should I? Doesn't this look familiar to you? Look what happened to me and Yulia! Don't you feel guilty at all? I... Annie? I suggest you call the police. No! No police! I still have to live stream tonight. And I won't be able to do that if you call the police. My fans will be very disappointed. There'll be a horde of reporters. And my image's black sugar will be ruined. I'm so scared now. I don't know when the next attack will be. Or where it will come from. <laughs> But my outfit for the live streaming. I was supposed to try to semi matured style for today's live streaming. So I picked the simple and elegant outfits. I I'm not sure if you have something like that.
What's up with you? Tired? That's the power of friendship. Sometimes the business demands it. After all, no fans would ever want to see their bad side. For the sake of their public image, they would never scowl at each other. However, what happened to Beth and Yulia for the past two days? Things are definitely getting tense in the group. Let's talk about the two incidents. Do they have anything in common? Watching who? You mean the members of Black Sugar? But we've stayed together most of the time. How can you be sure that the culprit was targeting the three of them? Good job! It seems that you're getting the hang of it. So, according to your deduction... What else do we know about the culprit? to be more careful from now on. After the live streaming is over, I'll talk to Annie personally. If they still refuse to call the police, and until we leave this island safely, nobody is to do anything alone. After the storage room incident, we should assume that the culprit will also attack you. Watch yourself out there. Do not trust anyone until we get more tangible evidence. Basically, yes. I mean it. Still, I'm glad to hear you say that. This trip was meant to be your graduation gift. Funny how it turned out this way. I know you just want to help me. But I also know that your dream is to study fashion design at Parsons School of Design. You wish to make my job easier. Likewise, I wish you wouldn't just give up on your dream. That's what you've always wanted since you were a kid. Besides, I'm a famous detective now. I'm sure I can afford your tuition. <sighs> One more thing. There's actually another reason why I want you to study fashion design. The truth is, we can achieve something that no one else can. You must have seen the clothes as bright and shiny as those worn by idols on the stage, mustn't you? A Black Sugar live show would be even sweeter. Now can you try changing into something like this?
that's exactly what I'm trying to tell you. We all have a special ability to explore people's memory. Yes, I used to think that it was an ability that I should steer clear of. But then, I realized how it can actually do more good than harm. Now I'm ready to work on it. I call it mind simulation. You lost some of your childhood memories, but now that you're growing up, and that it's dangerous here, it's time for you to activate the ability to protect yourself. Do what you are good at and elicit sentiments from others so that you can collect it. When you've collected adequate sentiments, it's time for you to activate the mind simulation. You can empathize with others through styling. It may have something to do with your talent for fashion design. Good design touches people, so the better your design is, the more it can resonate with others. Because you don't have Inner Realm, a system helping you activate your ability. It was supposed to be your birthday present, but I'll give it to you right now. It can read your level of design and instructs you what outfits might help elicit more sentiments. Well, I'll tell you after you master it. It will automatically pop up instructions on Vana, then go check your phone. It's okay, I just had a flashback. Mom and Dad passed away because of an accident when we were little. You may not remember what happened back then. But there's something you have to remember. We're only alive now because of what they sacrificed for us. But we must live our- Sweet, I don't mind retiring early. Oh, how I look forward to that day. Well, let's try out your birthday present today. Your wanna rings for new messages.
I wanted to remind you to enable I's smart alarm system before going to bed. But you didn't reply to my messages. I got worried, so I came to check in on you guys. I'm just glad that you're okay. She deduced that the culprit might be very familiar with the surrounding here. It's likely they'll strike again. I'll be fine. Instead of worrying about me, you should be enabling the robot's alarm system. The system can be connected to the electronic door lock and the window. If someone tries to break in, the alarm will sound off immediately. Additionally, it can detect the distress in your voice and automatically call for the police. So, to be safe, you should take it everywhere with you. That's right. The system is very helpful. Thank you. Oh, by the way, I'm planning to celebrate my sister's birthday on the beach at 12 tonight. Why don't you come to join us? Your birthday? What would you like for your birthday? <laughs> You're very welcome. It's a deal then. We'll meet at midnight on the beach just outside the villa. Don't be late. I've got a surprise just for you. You'll find out soon. All you have to worry about is getting dressed up and being there on time.
Good evening. Would you like to go to the hot spring together? We're done with the live streaming. So I want to take a dip before calling it a day. But... But after what happened in the past two days, I'm afraid to go alone. Oh, I didn't expect Gerald to be here too. Are you guys in the middle of something? Sorry for interrupting. It's fine. I think it's a good idea to take a dip before going to bed too. Let's go. Whose birthday is it? <sighs> of course. I'll tell Beth and Annie to come too. It was perfect. The support we get from our fans is what keeps us going. I didn't know what it was like before. But I do now. I forgot all about my worries when our fans cheered for us. That's awesome. I hope Annie and Beth feel the same way as you do. I'm... I'm sure they do. I'll walk you guys there. Oh, sure. Thank you. Ding! New message! What's going on? Why? Take me to the switchboard. It's... it should be nearby. I'll take you there. Just a short circuit? Hmm. It's 
probably because of the lighting just now. Yeah, power outage is pretty common here. Especially during the thunderstorms. I should be able to get it fixed soon. You guys... <coughs> what the...? That's Beth's voice! It came from the hot spring! Get over there now! What? But I'm scared! It's so... It's so dark! <laughs> I'm almost done. Head is injured, but her body is still warm. She was just attacked. But this injury shouldn't be fatal. Unless. Quick, open her mouth! See if her tongue is obstructing her airway. How's Annie doing now? Is she. Luckily, we found her in time. She's breathing again now. So... I need to treat her wound now. Take her back to her room. Thank you. 
But you're a fashion designer, aren't you? Wonderful. <laughs> Let me upgrade I for you. It'll be able to access Ashley's on-site scanning and physical evidence analysis system. It'll also be able to make a record of your findings. This is one of the projects my company has been working on with the firm. I didn't expect it to come in handy here. After scanning the scene, it'll mark the points of interest. However, those not marked could also contain useful information. I'll let you be the judge. Thank you. 